the Black Cleaver. Very significant buffs to that item, which does help combat uh, a lot of the tank champions. Uh, some people have just decided that it's not quite enough, but Huni, he did find a pink ward. There's not a lot of help for Zig. They might just go for it. He's out of mana. They go for the dive. Zig has already popped the ulti. No, he hasn't done Whoa. it just yet. Execute there from Huni, but a good flash out of the wind slash might get Zig to safety. Huni, though, will claim first button. It's just that easy. Doesn't even reacquire turret. Ah, he can. He can have the, the very spectacular flash plays, but he can also... Uh-oh, arrow under the turn and Zig again! Oh, he's dead. He Pope just with the revived! Ulti. Well, good arrow there from Turtle this time. Doesn't nail that one. You have the early Black Cleaver for shredding, as well as movement speed on top of it. And now with the 5% damage reduction... Oh, oh, Turtle! Pretty good rebel, but there's nowhere to jump to, so it's just going to delay the inevitable. Yep. Execute there from Hooney off the wind slash is all they need. Turtle, another great arrow despite the road. Just happy to check in. They might be able to get good damage to the turret. Yeah. Well, since so, Mortals have done such a good job early. Let's talk about how it's going to look like... Oh, never mind. Yeah, Pope also getting moved back there by the Azira ulti. Stunned there by Brawn Passive, and Slushy cleans one up. No perfect game this time. Now Turtle, actually, maybe the second casualty. Mash able to claim him there. Zig does TP in. P1 on the initiative. There's the first move from P1. They're able to take out the kills, plus the mid turret. They should be able to continue pushing. A, a little bit desperate here. Huni is available. Everyone else from Mortals is converging as well. Slushy. Oh, they lock him down. The Baron stops auto. The rest of the P1 are there, and they've actually found the ribbon. Huni gonna get stunned up there. His gate falls in the ulti after the wind, uh, concussive blows. Now gonna move back in, but Mash, an easy one there for him. Pobelt are shoving out mid lane. I guess P1 are off Baron. Yeah, <laughs> important pickup right there. They get a man off the field, and five versus four means they come <laughs> back for the uh, uh, Phoenix team, but it might cost them. Is he safe under his Suntorid? I guess we'll find out. Rainover gets pushed back in, but Turtle's there with a bit of damage. Rainover happy to tank for as long as he oh. can, but the damage is maybe enough from Slushy. Turtle lives this time, but that was all Ulti. he cannot. No, not gonna be there. Ulti, looking for someone, doesn't find it with the arrow, but Huni with a flank. Maybe looking to get involved. If it's a teammate, why not? Now pops the ulti, you know, to gate, damage is there. Gate gonna keep trying to run. Huni will chase him down for now, but the mortals want some more. Zenton will actually the next target there from Rainover. His gate's locked up on the other side. Huni is gonna take him out with the fight moving out on two fronts. Zenton will also take in a mortals just catching the sloppy Phoenix one around the Baron area. Yep, Baron of Power recalls, they can go perch. Oh. Yeah, but the pressure anyway is five. It is also kind of hard, I guess, for Mortals to dive this since there's a Zier wall plus Braum shield. Um, but they're whittling this turret down really quickly. Yeah, Turtle tank in the turrets as well, but the ult out from Braum's gonna start something here. Huni, though, gonna block off Gabe from coming in, and now Zig gonna get aggressed on. Now kind of going for the dive. Rain of it taking too much damage. Mash actually gonna take him out on the front side. And he's down. That wasn't even a full commitment to a dive. Phoenix pull off the defense here. We're able to ward off Immortals for a little while. Oh, they go in! Lucy, big play, but it's not enough. Adrian actually gets him on the back end as Turtle does the damage. Huni now diving in for it, and that's a massacre. Turtle picks up a double for himself and breaks the base straight down. Zentinel, not so lucky as well. Pobelta wipes him off the rift. Well, that's going to cut down on a lot of game time right there. They had the defense, but Slushy goes in for the hero play. Turns out it was a zero play. He goes down, a couple of other members, and it might even be the game as they stick around with Baron buff after that. Starts looking very vulnerable. They'll probably get one, if nothing else. Immortal's looking to keep pressuring. Mash has to be awfully careful here. That's one. Immortal's going to keep going. Yep, that is going to be it. Immortal's finished this one out cleanly Ooh. in game number two. Just over 26 minutes. 2-0 for Immortal. And that's all it took.